So we're here on the river and there's a current going that way. Now if we just place our fly straight like that, we are at the mercy of the current. The current's going to do whatever it wants with that fly. And we don't want that, we want control over that fly. We want to slow it down or speed it up. Now, we talked in recent tutorials about things called curve casts, like that, okay? Or hump casts, like that. And they are all ways to slow down or speed up the fly. But there's another way called mends. And we've basically got two different types of mends. We've got upstream and downstream. If the current's going that way, we're on the left bank, if we put an upstream mend in, it's gonna slow down the path of the fly. Let me show you. Here I am, here I am. Here's an upstream mend. And the fly is carrying on its vertical drift downstream, almost dead drift. If we put a downstream mend in, it's gonna speed up the swing across that current. Good if a, a salmon or a trout wants to chase a fly. That's basically it. You've got upstream and downstream mends. You've got another type of mend, which is like a, a stack mend, like this. You're just adding slack into that drifting fly. Now on top of that, we can either do the mends two ways. We can cast the fly and then when it's on the water, put an upstream mend in or a downstream mend in. The downside to that is that, if you look, it creates water disturbance. It's not too bad when you're on this really broken water, but another problem is that it, when you move the rod tip, it jumps the fly, it drags the fly on naturally. So it's better to do what we call an aerial mend. And an aerial mend happens after we've made the rod stop on the forward cast, there, and then we put the upstream mend in there. So now we don't have to alter the line in any way. The fly is drifting exactly how we want it. Oh, and here we go, we can do a downstream aerial mend like that. And now it's skating across naturally. As soon as it lands, it's behaving exactly how we want. And that's basically aerial and waterborne upstream and downstream mends.